Hey guys, welcome to this video. This is Human from Toolhouse and today I'm super excited to share with you a cool project that I've been working on and it's going to blow your mind. Okay, so if you haven't watched my last video, pause this video and go check that out. There I give you a full recipe of how you can create agents on Toolhouse, put them in your Telegram using NA10 so you have your agents ready for you to interact in your pocket so you have your agents sitting in telegram but today i want to show you something special in godot so your agents are characters in your game and people can interact with them and get their stuff done they can be automation they can be something fun or they can be something more serious so it's going to blow your mind okay pause the video sign up to toolhouse check our latest video and let's get started all right, we're in the Godot engine. This is the first scene, the world scene. So if you're not familiar with game development, you can do this in different game engines, whether it's Unity, Unreal, or uh, whatever game engine you're working, as long as there is a HTTP request functionality within that game engine. So today I'm going to show you the Godot project that I've been working on. So this is how it looks. And let's get started already. Great. We got the quests here. We got our main character, our world has chickens, so we got chickens in the fence and you can just explore the world. There is this Michael Jackson <laughs> sheep just wandering around and we got our social. So if you go on these tiles and you press a key, they're going to open our socials for you and we are going to, to the, we're going to the house. Okay, let's go to the house. So the idea is everything is interactable in your world. So you can turn on your TV, probably get some news, go on your bed, probably get some other stuff. And then the idea here is to go to the dungeon. So we're going to the dungeon. All right, so we're in the dungeon. We see this NPC, the vampire NPC. Our agent is here. So let's interact with a keystroke. Perfect. Greetings, stranger. What brings you to this cursed land? Before we continue our conversation, tell me what's your name. All right, you can interact with the agent and just type in your name. I'm going to give it my name. Perfect. Ahuman with a fascinating name. Perfect is already complimenting me. And we can go on, continue, and have these conversations going on. Perfect. Now the agent says, Now, Human, I have witnessed centuries of cinema ask for movie recommendations so in our previous video if you haven't watched that i created this movie agent that uh, give you some movie recommendations i just swapped it and put it in this game and here is how it looks so i'm going to type in some movie recommendations since halloween is upcoming i'm going to say uh, scary halloween movies Perfect. The agent is thinking, so it's using that uh, MCP server and coming up with the answer. Before it shows you the whole response, I want to take you to the Toolas platform. So if you go to app.toolas.ai, go to agent runs, you're going to see this uh, agent in action. So the new interaction, which is in Godot and in our universe, if you interact with an a NPC, this will send a Toolhouse request. Uh, that is there. I'm going to show you how that looks. So you're going to see this. It's already in progress. So I just entered that and you can see my prompt Halloween the scary movies and it returns uh, JSON output with movies title year genre and description. So everything comes back nicely. So if I go back now Perfect, we got the whole thing. So it recommended Halloween movie trick-or-treat or conjuring you have the whole output parsed in the game so the year and the genre and the description of the movies are all there you can just get movie recommendations from this uh, npc so if you press one you get more recommendations or if you press two it will say just farewell so i'm done with this agent let's just call it a farewell all right may these films haunt your dreams and boom the vampire dies in front of you after he did that so this is the whole godot demo tutorial that i built so you can just go around in your world interact with objects and they are your ai agents all right so but actually how i'm using tools here right so if you head over to the scripts this is where you keep your scripts for your game and i define this 
dialogue constants here. This is just the constants for the game. You can see already here, the API, we have this toolhouse base URL, which is my agent. So whenever I interact with the character in the game, this uh, request will be sent. And if you want to open that request, you can just copy this, head over to your browser. And when you open that, you can see, since it's public, you can see my agent and you can see the agent ID and everything about my agent. So if I grab that ID here, I can just go app.toolhouse.ai slash agents and slash the agent here. You're going to see how that agent was constructed. You can get the agent file from it. So if I head over to the code, I'm going to see the whole uh, agent file, the YAML file. I can download it and use it. But the way I created this agent was to just go to Agent Studio and say create movie uh, recommender agent i gave it the mcp server and said the user will ask for movie recommendations and that's it i just defined the schema so things always come uh, in this format and we're good to go two prompts made that happen so if you like this creative stuff you liked creating games building games or just playing games let me know in the comments i always read the comments if you like to create your own world we can make it happen for you so just leave a comment in YouTube or join our Discord and ask me for it. I'm going to make a whole uh, template for you so you can just input your characters. You have to just leave a comment. All right, so this is it for today. If you'd like to see a quick tutorial of how you can paint stuff, create stuff and make them move and come to life, you know the drill, leave in the comments. And with that being said, if you like Toolhouse and if you want to be a part of our paid plans make sure you use code human at the checkout that will give you 50 percent off on our paid plans toolhouse is free sign up today i see you in the next videos and bye bye everybody